let's discuss set variable call and how to create input parameters for it when using EFI variable authentication tree descriptor. First of all, we're starting with EFI variable authentication tree descriptor structure creation. We have to choose descriptor type. Uh, there are two types as we discussed, timestamp and nonce. In case of timestamp, uh, it, it is very similar to authentication tool. So first of all, we need EFI time uh, structure, which contain uh, timestamp. In case of uh, nonce type, uh, we have to create a secondary descriptor, which will be attached right after the authentication tree descriptor. Uh, this secondary descriptor is authentication tree nonce descriptor. In case of uh, updating or dele deleting the authentication tree nonce type, if we are doing update or deletion, we have to, to provide a nonce buffer of existing variable uh, for hashing purposes. So it is added to uh, additional content, uh, content to hash, uh, which should already also contain new variable uh, value. If we're not doing update or deletion, we're just skipping that step. Uh, then we're checking the variable authentication flags, uh, the authentication tree flags. If we got the enhance out flag update cert flag set, uh, then we have to provide new certificate to our additional content to hash. We have to concatenate it in our additional content to hash. Uh, in case if flag is not set, then we're just moving forward to hashing. In case of uh, producing hash for, for, for their signing, we provide as in case of authenticated to uh, variable name, vendor GUID, attributes, uh, our secondary descriptor, if dep which depends on the type, either we have timestamp, either we have nonce, new variable content and whatever additional content uh, to hash we have based on the flags or based on the type of the uh, descriptor. Then we sign this hash, we create create win certificate UFI GUID with certificate type PKCS7. Then we construct uh, their encoded signed data structure, which contain uh, previously signed hash. And then we update the EFI variable authentication metadata size with information about uh, metadata sites. So this is whole size except uh, size of our variable new content. Then we concatenate serialize the uh, scriptor uh, with the variable new content and we provide that to uh, set variable call. 